Hey everyone, I'm Jordan and I'm a part of the team here at Covenant. This past weekend, Pastor Branson talked about uh, the verse in Proverbs and it was Proverbs 1, 7. So I'm gonna read it for you this morning and then I wanted to spend just a minute to talk about it. It says, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge, but fools despise wisdom and instruction. So for me, I think this verse is key because it's, it's the order of it is different than how I naturally think. So I usually think the knowledge that I obtain is going to put me in a position. But what this verse is, is showing us through the word beginning is that the fear of the Lord is the beginning. So first comes the fear of the Lord and then comes knowledge, not the other way around. I think the other key word is fear. And this isn't like a scary type of fear. But it's, it could be also known as like the highest regard for who God is, the highest respect and honor for Him. And so when we read that verse, it's saying that when I put God at the highest place in my life first, then becomes knowledge that I will not be a fool. I will receive wisdom and instruction if God is first and the highest in my life, if it is beginning with Him. For me personally, I see when I don't do this, when I start a conversation with someone and I've entered the conversation already having my mind made up. So I know what I'm gonna say and I don't really even care to hear what this person has to tell me. So not only am I not really listening, but while they're speaking, I'm actually coming up with that response in my head. I already know what I'm gonna, what I'm gonna respond to them because I don't wanna receive their wisdom or their instruction, or their opinion. And I think that another place I see it in my life is, is simply when I put things above God, when I put things above spending time with Him, that my fear of Him, my um, seeing Him in the highest place gets out of whack or off balance. So my encouragement to you this week would be to uh, to pray and use this verse as a prayer and ask the Holy Spirit, can you show me places in my life where I am not putting you first? That I'm not, I don't have a view of, of God as the highest uh, and, and top priority in my life. And ask the Holy Spirit to show you those, those situations in your life. Um, and maybe that looks like asking Him to show you when you get into those conversations where you've already walked in with your mind made up and you're not willing to listen to other people. Ask God to show you times when you're in relationship with people and you're not wanting to listen to any instruction that they have. So that is my encouragement and my prayer for myself this week, but also for you. I would love for you to keep watching these devotionals. We're gonna have more that come out next week. And I'd also love for you to join us online this weekend at one of our services.